Hello, everyone. This is Javed Sir from JEFY YouTube channel. Today, we're going to dive into the fascinating world of historical periods. You've probably heard terms like Victorian or Elizabethan and wondered what they mean and when they occurred. Well, today's your lucky day because we're going to explore these periods and more. Let's start with the medieval period, also known as the Middle Ages. This period spans several centuries and is known for its Gothic architecture and the works of Geoffrey Chaucer, a renowned writer in English literature. Chaucer, who lived from the 1340s until 1400, wrote in Middle English, a style of English that was prevalent during the Middle Ages. Next, we have the Tudor period, which began in 1485 with the reign of Henry VII and ended in 1603. This period saw significant religious changes, with the country transitioning from Catholicism to Protestantism under Henry VIII, then back to Catholicism under Mary, and finally returning to Protestantism under Elizabeth I. The reign of Elizabeth I, known as the Elizabethan Age, was a golden era for literature, with the works of Shakespeare gaining popularity. Following the Tudors, the Stuarts came to power, starting with James I in 1603. This period, known as the Jacobean period, also saw the continued success of Shakespeare, However, the reign of Charles I led to the English Civil War due to his attempts to seize power from Parliament. This resulted in his execution and the establishment of the Commonwealth period under Oliver Cromwell, where there was no king or queen. The monarchy was eventually restored in 1660 with the reign of Charles II, marking the beginning of the Restoration period. This period saw the reopening of theatres, which had been closed during the Commonwealth period, and for the first time, women were allowed to perform on stage. The Hanoverian or Georgian era followed, beginning in 1714. This period was named after the four successive kings named George and the fact that the royal family hailed from Hanover in Germany. The Georgian period was marked by stability and the avoidance of religious conflict. The Victorian era, named after Queen Victoria, spanned from 1837 to 1901. This period was characterized by industrial development, social change, and the expansion of democracy. It was also the era of Charles Dickens, one of the most famous novelists in English literature. The Edwardian period followed the Victorian era, with the reign of Edward VII from 1901 to 1910. The early part of the 20th century was marked by two world wars, with World War I from 1914 to 1918 and World War II from 1939 to 1945. These wars had a profound impact on society and culture, including the emergence of war poets who wrote about their experiences. Finally, we have the Second Elizabethan Age, which began in 1952 with the reign of Queen Elizabeth II. This period has been marked by stability and progress, and at the time of this video, Queen Elizabeth II is still the reigning monarch. That's it for our brief overview of English history. Remember, this is just a basic outline and doesn't cover every single king or queen. If you're interested in learning more about these periods, I encourage you to do some research and delve deeper into each era. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to the Hayfree channel for more educational content.
See you in the next video.